you're looking to put in a new CCTV solution or just extend out your Unify solution to include Protect. In this video, we'll take a look at what options you have and what products you can use in certain scenarios. In this video, do note I will only cover products that run the Protect software, but don't worry, I have another video coming where I'll be covering everything you need to know about the Unify cameras. So if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and the bell to be notified when I release it. While I mention about subscribing, remember to hit that like button and comment down below. And just remember all the links I talk about in today's video are also in the description below. So let's start with what's in the Protect lineup. There are a few different things you can use to run the Unify Protect software. That is the Cloud Key Gen 2 Plus, the Network Video Recorder, the NVR, the Network Video Recorder Pro, the UDM Pro, and the recently announced the UDM Pro SE, which at the time of this recording is still in early access. Let's start by comparing each of these in terms of the specifications and what you can do with them. The Cloud Key Gen 2 Plus. This product runs Unify Protect and the Unify Network Controller software. It can run up to 20 cameras in 1080p if you're only running Protect, or 15 cameras if you're also using the network controller. In terms of storage, it has a one terabyte drive, which can be upgraded up to five terabytes. It has three gigabytes of RAM and an APQ8053 processor. It has one gigabit ethernet port for connectivity, and the price is £171 in the UK and $199 in the US. This product can be used for either scenario, whether you're looking to set up Protect on its own, or if you already have one of these, you can add the functionality for Unify Protect. The ideal scenario would be something small to set up at home or very small business or a single office, or even if you're looking to play around with the features that come with Protect with a couple of cameras. Next, the UNVR. This product only does run Unify Protect, but that being said, it can run up to 50 cameras. It has space for four 2.5 inch or 3.5 inch drives. It has an ARM A57 1.7 gigahertz processor and it has four gig of RAM. Connectivity wise, it has one gig ethernet port and one gig SFP plus port. Price in the UK is 257 pounds and in the US it's 299 dollars. The UNVR would be perfect for a larger setup where data retention might be more important. Not only does it allow more storage space, but it has RAID 1 and RAID 5 capabilities in case you lose a drive. It also allows you to have more cameras as I mentioned earlier. Next, we have the big brother to the UNVR, the UNVR Pro. This is an upgrade from it. Again, it only runs the Protect software. However, this allows up to 60 cameras. So instead of the four drives you had earlier, you now have seven, and this also includes RAID 10 along with RAID 1 and 5. Unify don't specify the specs in terms of this machine, but from the research I've done, it seems they have the same spec as the UNVR. If anyone knows otherwise or has anything different, let me know down in the comments below. Connectivity wise, it's the same, one gig ethernet, one 10 gig SFP plus port, Price in the UK is £431 and in the US $499. The UNVR Pro allows a few extra cameras and three extra storage drive. Again, this would be ideal for a larger setup or if you need it longer recording time or even constant recording. Next is the UDM Pro. This will run all the Unify applications, so that's Protect, Network, Talk and Access. Unify don't actually specify how many cameras will run on this, but if you're using the other applications, I'd imagine it wouldn't be that many cameras. In terms of storage, you have one bay, which is a 2.5 or 3.5 inch bay, it's up to you. It has the same A57 1.7 gigahertz processor and four gig of RAM. Connectivity, you have nine one gig ethernet ports and two 10 gig SFP plus ports. The price for this one is £271 in the UK and $379 in the US. Similarly to the Cloud Key Gen 2 Plus, if you have a few cameras and the data wasn't critical, this would be something you would set up. Now finally, the UDM Pro SE. There is limited information on this, but from what I have found from Ubiquiti's video they released a while back, the spec is the same as the UDM Pro, however it now includes 8 PoE ports. 
So this could be the all-in-one solution product that you may need. Which leads me nicely to the next part in terms of what scenario would you use what products in. So in one scenario, let's say you wanted to set up Protect by itself. You need to look at how many cameras you need and how important the data is to you. The Cloud Key or the UDM Pro would be useful in a home setup or a single office or a very small office where the data being saved is not very important, if anything was to happen to it. Now, when you're looking at something where you need more data retention, then perhaps the UNVR or the UMVR would be more a suitable option. The Protect Only solution will need to be plugged into an existing network. Another scenario, if you already have a unified network set up already, chances are you have some sort of cloud key or UDM device running your network for you. In this case, if you have a UDM, a UDM Pro can replace it. And if you have a cloud key, the Cloud Key Gen 2 Plus would replace that. This gives you the ability to add protect. That's assuming you want a smaller scale setup. If you want something a bit larger or you want the drive capabilities, then the UNVR or the UNVR is the one for you. You could plug this straight into your existing network. Do keep in mind either of these scenarios, you'll need to power the cameras via a PoE switch or you'll need to add a PoE injector to each camera. This is where the UDM Pro SE may be at an advantage as this allows you to plug them straight into the eight ports built in. I hope you found this video useful. Remember, I do have some more videos coming on the Unify cameras, so watch this space and make sure you have the bell notification turned on. When it comes to setting up these devices, Unify have a really cool feature on their website. So if you go to any of the products like the UNVR or the UNVR Pro, it has a slider scale on their website. What you can do with this is specify how many cameras you're gonna have set up, whether it's G4 or G3, you can specify how many and it will tell you how long the recording feature is for. The other thing to note is they do have a hard drive compatibility link. So if you're looking to add drives into your system, so before you buy any drives, be sure to click on the link and I'll leave that down in the description below. One final thing, the products that I've spoken about in this video are in the description below. This is Inside Wire and I'll see you in the next one.